Okay, let's start this uh, little video out here before we get too wet here and I have to put the camera away. Uh, Muslim, Mrs. Muzzle Mike, oh, Mrs. Muzzle Mike is actually out of the hospital. She got out uh, yesterday. Yesterday around morning. It took forever to get her out and do the discharge papers and everything else. But she's home. She's doing. She's home. She's doing well. Um. I'm heading out to get a, uh, actually get the goat filled up, get some uh, bills paid, and uh, getting all set up for the August trip, the August meetup, which is going to be cool. my uh, batteries for the camera last night they will be coming in plenty of time they're saying no later than the 10th but we'll see we'll see they uh, uh, I did uh, the, the, the batteries that I ordered. I got off. I'm getting off of Amazon. They are. They were what? 1995, I believe it was. Free shipping if if it's under 25 dollars on the order. So I went ahead and ordered a uh, a tripod mount to go with my GoPro. Even though it'll be a guess and shoot type setup. I mean, I might use it, I might not, who knows, but for a few bucks, what the heck. It saves me shipping, I'm a greedy little butthead. I mean, that's how that works, so. Yeah, uh, I got a lot of good res uh, response from my last video, uh, whenever I was on the country road. Which I am planning on going back whenever I have a... I know that, absolutely know that my camera's not smudged, hopefully. Which, I mean, that was nothing but a... I had a lens cleaning cloth I always use, and... Uh, and the spray in my box, my tank bag, which ends up... There was something on it. That I didn't know was on it, and I ended up smudging my camera and my case lens. So I mean, that that turned out like crap. Which I apologize, but I didn't want to waste that that video because even though there was a lot of video that I ended up throwing away, it was a good ride. It was a great ride. There's an old money. There's an old uh, money. What the fuck am I saying? Oh, you guys know what it is. What am I saying? El Camino. I can remember those as a kid. Do you remember them as a kid? And I'll tell you what, if I could get a few more, much more drops, I won't end up putting the camera away. This is not really an interesting ride anyway. Like I said, it's just heading down, I'll be paying some bills. And uh, filling the bike up. I haven't filled the bike up since the uh, last trip down to Newcomers Town. And I, I mean, I did put some gas in on the way up, not a whole lot, like a gallon. And I got a hundred and almost a hundred, a hundred and thirty miles on, hundred and twenty-nine point seven, almost hundred and thirty miles on it. I figure, well, that's about, what, two, two and a half gallons. Let's go ahead and, uh, maybe three. Let's go ahead and, let's go ahead and top her off. And, uh, she's actually, for my little bit of riding around town, I'll have to put maybe a half a gallon in it to top it off for the trip. Which is, with me, it'll be cool. But 
Yes, as a repeat, uh, Mrs. Muzzle Mike is home. She is doing well. She's feeling a lot better since she's out of the hospital. Which I don't blame her. Um. She's got a hankering for steak salad tonight, so that's what I'll be making. Some good old steak salad. And I'm taking care of someone to run around, which I know I, I sometimes I do with the SUV, but I, I lightened up the goat today enough to pick up some stuff from the store and stuff. Which is, I mean, I prefer riding the goat anyway, even if it does sprinkle. Sprinkling is not a big deal to me, as long as it doesn't soak. And if it does soak, I just pull over and wait for 10, 10 minutes for the oils to wash off the roads and make it safer for me. I hope you all are having a great day, a great time. And if you're out riding, I hope you have all great rides. It is a nice day out today. It's nice and not too hot, not too cool. But we got just enough to kick off some sprinkles here and there. Which, I mean, it's not something that the goat hasn't seen in the past. All the time. All the time. Muzzle Mike, I'm on the YouTube. See ya! Yeah, he was just, I don't know if you guys heard, I, he was asking if I post much. Like, oh, all the time. It's nice to have people recognize you, even though the camera does stand out. I mean,. It means that we're out here. We are doing our doing what we like, what we love, and we're showing that the world our area and how we do things. I mean, it, it, I like that. Also, it's there if needed. If I mean, if we do get into a, a sticky spot, you know. And I'm, I hate to jinx myself to say exactly what I was I'm, I'm, I'm meaning, but you, you get the idea. Yeah, Muzzle Mike is a little bit of a cautionary person when it comes down to um, two things. And I mean, I have slipped up and said some things that I didn't mean to say to people. That uh, it was like a jinx. Well, you better knock on wood type thing. But it, it all works out in the end. Uh, as long as I mean. And, M and Mrs. Muzzle Mike, she was in the hospital. And that, this is just a slight explanation of what all happened. Yeah, she had double pneumonia, which is a lot worse on her than it was for me. Why? In the past, she worked with uh, she worked in a laboratory with rodents. And I can't say which laboratory, you know, what rodents and. It, what, what rat laboratory anyway? I can see what rodents and they're rats. And here, to come find out while she was working there, that she had a uh, she has an allergy to rats, and rodents. And by the time we found out and discuss and found, you know, found out what was going on, it was too late and already did damage to her lungs. So it, it, it was just not her dealing with the um, the pneumonia. It was her dealing with on top of the, on top of it with the pneumonia on top of her damage to her lungs she had in the past, which and also just a little over well, about a year and a half ago she dealt with um, blood clots going into her lung and. She dealt with that on top of it. I mean, it, it's all all built up. So it was a lot harder on her than it was for me. A lot more dangerous for her than it was for me. So. 
that kind of just, you know, brings that out to light to what she was going through. Yeah, I had a rough time going in, but I had an easier time getting out due to that. And she's still struggling. She still needs her breathing treatments and stuff for a while. And there are some things that she'll, I mean, like her inhalers and stuff, she'll just be on for the rest of her life. And it's not a, anything really different to what she was dealing with before. In time, she'll, she can use less inhaler, but, I mean, it, it just... Because of things she'll be dealing with. Okay, we're at my first spot. This is Muscle Mike. I'll be signing out. Hope you guys all have a great day. Ride safe. Keep the rubber down, rubber side down, shiny side up. And see you on the next one, guys.